All right, the next match on the card is going to be the Celtic Warriors Sheamus for Stone Cold. What? Steve Austin. What? 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 Oh, shit. This sounds a little whiny, babe. Calm down. Sorry. Sorry. Another fiddle full way? Another one. You want it? <laughs> Al, if you want TLC, just tell me. If I want to still see, he can make it. He's a fucking champion. Uh, who do you know the reason why? Because um, Finn Balor had four wins. The and then um, Cena and Warrior also had four wins. So. Shamus! Sheamus looks eager to get this one underway. Um, you guys, yeah, um, do you guys want to do anything uh, That's the big for, he looks geared up and ready for your attack titles as a. Um, as a uh, stipulation. Yeah, uh, you're third from some. Uh, you're third from Maine. And did Peyton select the match that he wants for tonight? Because I'm just gonna put him in a steel cage match. Because that's his, that was the one he won so quick. So if I if I um, I'm gonna I'm gonna give him a, a cage match. See the ones or no? All gonna return at the same time. Federal four he's a champ. That's not how you spell that, John. Stone SCF8 in a match. Stone Cold Steve Austin. No, Remy. I well, if he's not here, I can't really. Uh, I can't. Um, you know, sometimes a superstar just has that look in his eye. And this is one of those times. Two of WWE's absolute best preparing to square off here. <laughs> Sexy CrossFit Hell? No, oh, no, they're not in the tag match. All singles tonight. Um, Roy, did you guys want to do like a stipulation for your tag match tonight or just a regular match? Because I only have I'm and I, I only have one more stipulation match for the night and it's a uh, um it is a uh, cruiserweight match so i might even make a cruiserweight belt that'd be interesting for anybody on the smaller side with the character and there's the bell well if you like offense you're gonna get it in this one shame is fighting a shamus currently steve austin making his statement as we speak If Jeremy loses, I'm literally killing myself. It's not good. Don't do that. Kane loses is if I was Kane loses is retiring. Yeah, Brian switched from Kevin Owens. Wait, he's not Enzo anymore. Shit, I have to switch it out. I forgot he's not Enzo. He's Kevin Owens. in the future. Are you kidding me? Look. Hey, that's how you do it. Let me actually, oh God, hold on. Let me move that. You're not my crotch. Seamus seeks out a big move here. Finding a groove here. Oh, out of nowhere. And Seamus reverses it. Seamus is a superstar. He's broken a lot of barriers. And Gallagher, I'm switching you to uh, Russell Punk tonight. Barrier he's proudest to break in as being the first Irish-born champion in WWE history. Well, that's right, Cole. The Celtic Warriors sure. came straight from the old country, holding a big old... Has there been a two-time champ? Booty, uh, Peyton's won the People's Championship four times. It was pure guts. He took the championship off. Dogs is not a cage match. John Cena at Stream rules? Okay. In his rookie year in 2009. Now that was sure his quick to the top of WWE. Remy, you sound like you're pulling it out right now. Where am I in the ranks? Ow, you're, well, the main, the main title, if you lose it, you automatically have a, uh, a win for the next, for the next championship. Just, uh, since it's not a rematch clause type deal. Um, Punk, let me find oh, Punk. A terrific reversal by Steve Austin. So, as prestigious and groundbreaking as that first WWE Championship may have been for Sheamus. His World Heavyweight Championship win in 2012 was no less of an achievement. It came on the grandest stage of all at WrestleMania 28 against Daniel Bryan. If Sheamus' first title gave him a place on the map, that second one gave him his own area code. Good 
Oh my gosh, what a sick dud. This is inhuman. Okay. Um, because I, I, I remember Brian switches, so uh, APW Cage, what's up, APTW Cage, what's up, man? Um, because I thought, uh, Brian was still Enzo, but he switched to Kevin Owens, and I have a, uh, uh Cruiserweight ladder match going on tonight that I put, uh, put apart. Um, wait, I can change that around. I can put somebody else in the match. Hold on. Let me, uh, edit that again. Quick pin attempt here. Kevin Owens. Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. Uh, we're going to put you back against Amanda. Down, you might want to consider quitting right now, because nothing will. We may be looking at spaghetti legs after I'm going to put me versus Brian, and then Punk versus uh, Daniel Bryan. So we should be good. There we go. You just call me Cage? All right, man. So what's up, Cage? I have zero faith in me winning unless you manage your help. Brian Cage. I used to be a Becca wrestler, Cage, but I got trained. I, I used to do independence, independent wrestling and shit. One of the most bitter conflicts in WWE began relatively early in Jason Cage. And that was his war with the game Triple H. Who was in the ladder match? It's uh elimination chance. It's a Mysterio versus Kalisto versus Neville. In a ladder match. I thought it'd be fun to have a uh Luchador or a cruiserweight ladder match tonight. And the shoulders up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. Austin doesn't get tired, he gets mad. Oh, what a suplex. This guy has strength, that's for sure. Wait, is he still RTG? Man, Take it, there's free cards, free cards. Steve Austin doing a great job of turning what? that around. I found out that, like, your stats go up basically did the cards you keep are. I've been keeping all my cards to the new cards. That's why they're not as good as all What do you mean? Like, you know... King, I know you've seen your share of fierce rivalries. Neck during Sheamus' okay. early days, he even attacked you in the broadcast like, booth. But the cards, level like, of combat with Triple H went so fast that the, the game was out of action for almost a year following the street fight I, I and extreme it. rules. Oh, but you're right. In the throes of competition, championships, and so on, things definitely get heated. I said I've but when that something. turns into someone becoming John seriously Cena, injured, a rare or worse, Seth Rollins. their career's yeah. getting Just to see. That's when you know and then I fed it a common Seth Rollins. Oh, my! Look at that! Up this one is over. You're right. No one gets up from a stunner. Oh, yeah. No, I thought you were talking about the stats. The stats are automatically going to be what it's going to be. Yeah, the, the, the level, the amount of bar it gets up for your level, yeah. He simply refuses to stay down. Why? Why don't you just feed them all? It's going to be heated. Any experience is better than no experience. It's still going to be heated. Don't throw them away. It's I'm a... throwing them away. Going to have to shake off the moderate damage that's been inflicted <sighs> here and find a way to maintain Do not throw the them away. Hand. I'm muting myself. Hold on. A quick reversal by Sheamus. Whoa! Don't get up! Looking for the win. There it is, the high cross. I love that move, Cole. There's the finishing move. Don't know if you have anything left. This might be it. Two. And the shoulder's up. And the match continues. I love this. You know, it's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in his tank. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. Whoa. Listen, uh, uh John. Amanda says that she's only going to throw away all of her comment cards because they don't give her any XP. Explain this. Explain this to me. She says you to throw them all away because she's only going to feed them rares and uncommon. I don't understand it. Explain this to me because she won't listen to me. Maybe she'll listen to somebody else who's not me because I'm a dude of head. As she put it. Experience. That's not a position you want to be in. Yeah, I usually like saying. most positions, but not that I one. I feed all my comments because it's free XP. Okay. What a move! What a smart move! Sheamus sneaks out of that one. And I'm what? Sure I just, I'm trying to understand. On Sheamus's part. Holy fuck, calm down. No, you're the one that's not calm. Making his Better do whatever she wants. Speak. Listen now, I asked John. Well, he gets going like John's been playing this game for about six years, even though it's only been out since... 
uh, 14th of August of 2014. But, but let me ask you something. Amanda, they do give you a very little amount of XP. The two pages of comments give them level 8 to 20. Yeah. But I'm talking about... You're not talking about, like, the toughness, speed, and charisma and all that. Let me pull the game real quick. So I so we can be on the same page here. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right what? now. Why? Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. One. He's still not through. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. When it strikes land, you can feel it in the first few rows. Six. The body's taking some abuse here, but nothing that can't be shaken off. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. channels all their ability in one move. You get high octane offense like that. There's the cover. Can he do it? Think he's got him. He did it. What a huge win. I can't believe what we just saw. Highlight after highlight. Oh, they mesmerized the WWE Universe in that match. Okay, baby. My match going to be anything because my PC kicked me off. Anything goes. Roy, if you want it, man. What's up, Peyton? Peyton's Watch yelling this. at you. Peyton's yelling. Why? He's yelling, asking, what? I don't want you. <laughs> baby, we don't get the choice. Peyton's asking, how are you, babe? Oh, hi. <laughs>